Well, hello, hello, everybody. My name is Shay Too Sweet. You call me Shay for short. Pull that down a little bit, amen. Um, and we're gonna be doing episode three of Sort Out Online. I'm sorry, we gotta fix that because I don't know what that was doing. We're gonna be doing episode three of Sort Out Online abridged. Now, did I read the comments for episode three? Yes, I did. Yes, I did. Um, so. I'll make sure I play it all the way to the end, you guys. I'll be a resident black friend talking through the whole entire thing. Hey, look, look, I have got a black friend. What the fuck? Oh, so this is a Christmas? Oh, I said jump, you delightful Italian stereotype. Oh, hello. Didn't see you come in. I am Sir Jack Dapper. But of course you already knew that. No. It is my great honor today to introduce you to the Sword Art Online Christmas Extravaganza. A touching tale of whimsy adventure and the true meaning of friendship so i have my book i have my bourbon gather round children let's make some christmas this is the story of the red nosed reindeer who the hell only has that much bourbon i'm sorry wow that sounded like an alcoholic that's not even a taste of it okay i'm sorry <laughs> Never understood that when it came to storytelling. <laughs> that niggas start in the middle of a damn book. They be like, okay, let me tell you an adventure. And they start, they don't start on page one. They just open up the book and it'd be like, time to read. And be like, uh, so what the, did the first 30 pages was that? Was that, it's not the epilogue. Hold up. Se Matt, what's the first pages in a novel? that niggas normally miss like skip over it's not the epilogue it's the what it's the prologue right nice work brain you're welcome yeah y'all skipping over the prologue ain't like that ain't important okay okay we gonna go ahead and skip skip well, journey began in april apparently that's a bit odd guess we're going for a slow burn on this one. Oh well i can dig it as the kids would say our story began at the local davening hole, where our hero, Kirito, had just made some new friends. Or homies, if you will. I'll stop now. Please, Kirito! Who are you people, and why are you at my table? Ah, oh, Kirito. Can I call you Kirito? No. Here's the thing, Kirito. I couldn't help but noticing while I was rifling through your character page... I thought I had that set to private. ...that you are not associated with any guilds. So the crew and I... I call them the crew, by the way. We're thinking that you should join our guild. Yeah, I'm not gonna do that. Now, I know what you're thinking. Am I really worthy to join these awesome dudes? I've literally never thought that about anyone. But let me assure you, we could certainly use someone with your... Assets. Ugh. Hey, hey, my eyes are down here. Right, right. So what do you say, Key? Can I call you Key? God, no! <laughs> mm, I see. And what if I put on this hat? Oh, don't be ridiculous. What the hell am I signing? To the newest member of the Moonlit Black Cats, Takirito! Damn it! So let me introduce you to the crew. I call them the crew, by the way. So I've heard. This here is Sachi. And, uh, the rest are NPCs. Wait, what? What? Yeah, they're all companions from different quests. They help you fight, and as long as you never finish, they stay with you. We must save my family! The bandits are coming! <laughs> um, is that important? Nah, it's just part of the quest. They say that, like, every four seconds. <gasps> oh my god. <gasps> that reminds me of Fallout. Oh my god. I played Fallout 4, and you know when they want you to make a decision of what crew you gonna go with, like... Either you're gonna go with the Brotherhood, either you're gonna go with the Settlers, or you're gonna go with the the Simps, like the uh like which yo yo your weird son. I never picked. I never really picked uh with with one playthrough, and I just milked everybody out of their stuff because I was like, bro, I'm making too much money. Nah, then they'd be like, y'all, hey you want to go on this raid and we're going to raid this stuff and I'll let them raid some stuff. But then I'll be like, I didn't kill anything. So I would be fine. And I, I just let dog meat kill people and it's not my fault. He, he was hungry. So I'm, I, I just looked the other way. <laughs> really nigga. Always remember to jump, jump. And uh, he's from the tutorial. It's not a good tutorial. Winners don't use drugs, except steroids. In which case, use lots of drugs. Wait, so you never finished the tutorial? Hey, just because I can't play the game doesn't mean I can't play the game, wink. I feel like you don't know how winking works. Th 
Thank you for joining our guild, Mr. Kir 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 Kirito. Sweet merciful Buddha, what the fuck? Now, now, don't panic. Sachi just lives out in the boonies, so our internet connection is kind of <laughs> shit. Oh god, it's spreading! Grab the women and children! Yeah, we're using a shield! Haha, <laughs> what shenanigans. Four people died in that fire. But from the ashes sprouted a powerful friendship. And in time, Kirito found that he could almost tolerate them. Much like a fat man tolerates the tapeworms in his intestines. And like those tapeworms, that guild burrowed deep into his innards and gorged themselves on his leftovers until they began causing abdominal pain and diarrhea. What the hell are you on about? Yeah. I realize the metaphor's breaking down a bit here, but Granny Dapper didn't raise no quitters. In any case, things were about to change for young Kirito as he learned one fateful night. Hey, Kirito buddy! Sachi kinda ran off and we don't know where she went. Could you be a pal and track her down? I'd look for her myself, but the NPCs are sorta blocking the door and I can't get out. We must save my family! <laughs> <laughs> Listen, buddy, I'm gonna need your help sooner rather than later. I'm starting to think this is a two-man job. You've been playing for... 4,608... Hours! Maybe you should take a break! I would if I could, Mom! But that's not really enough to do, is it? <laughs> bruh... I got stuck, bruh. I got stuck... I got stuck in a house... In GTA... It was a stripper glitch. Yeah, yeah, give me a minute. Now, the thing is, in GTA 5, you can invite strippers over to your home, right? But the thing is, I was trying to leave. I was trying to leave and everything else. So my homeboy came over to my house and we were like, oh, okay, cool, cool. But I dismissed the stripper and then I was trying to go to the door, but she wouldn't move. So I was like, hey, yo, man, just come into the door. He couldn't come in. We were literally stuck there. And I was, he was like, well, did you pay her? I said, N I think so. I don't know. And I tried to talk to her and she would not move from the door. We were stuck in that stripper glitch for about five minutes. I laughed my ass off. If I could find the old, old, my old streaming footage from that, bro, that would be, no, nah, that's going to take too long. But is a stripper glitch that you can, that, that will happen if you invite a stripper over to your house and you like dismiss them and you're trying to leave before they do, they will stick you in the door. They, they, you won't be able to leave until the stripper leaves. And then that stripper basically made herself at home. Like she would not fucking leave. And then you can't kill anybody in your house because I couldn't pull out my guns in my house, so I couldn't kill her. Really, nigga? So j just keep the strippers in the strip club. There you go. Now he's clipping through the wall. This is just perfect. Ah. So, yeah, if you could take care of that for me, that'd be great. Yeah, good luck with that, Kata. It's my day off. And because I know it's your day off, I went ahead and included a little motivation. Right. Kata, when have you ever had anything I... I hate that goddamn hat! <laughs> Yo, Sachi, Kata said you ran off or... Jesus Christ, what's wrong with your eyes? What? <laughs> oh, right, detective mode. One sec. <laughs> oh, that's brisk. Is it supposed to hurt like that? I don't think so. Unless the game is developed by a sadist. Well... Yeah, I heard it! So anyway, I figure I got about, oh, five minutes before I black out from the pain. So, Princess, why'd you run off? Because I'm terrified my leg is going to get me and everyone I love killed. Yes. Well, shit, I don't know how to mock that. <laughs> oh, God, that's never happened before! Well, maybe this is something you don't need to mock. Uh, <laughs> okay. But Bullshit. then what's the point of other people if not to mock them? You know, I'm starting to see why people think you're an asshole. People think I'm an asshole?! And so they talked all through the night, and slowly, Kirito began to see the error of his ways. If that seems like a combo to you, congratulations! You get a cookie. Wow, Sachi, you've really opened my eyes. I've been such a jerk. Well, no more. You're looking at a whole new Kirito. From now on, I'm going to be nicer and show people the compassion they deserve. So, can we talk about my problems now? Ugh, no one cares. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I thought you said you were going to black out from the pain. Oh, yeah. Guess I'm just a lot tougher than a th- Hey, crew. I know you guys have been working really hard, and I've got some good news. And? Uh, and some bad news. The good news is we're in debt to the mob. No, wait, that's the bad news. 
Also, there's no good news. There's a mob in this game? Uh, yeah, I may have promised some, let's say, unsavory individuals that I could duplicate their rare item. And, well, it turns out that got patched. So, then why don't you just give back their item? Yeah, well, here's the thing. I kind of sold it, and now... The bandits are coming! Precisely! But the Don says all will be forgiven if we replace the item. Well, okay, that doesn't sound too... Here's the thing. There it is. It only drops on the 27th floor. Is that a problem? Well, uh, let me put it this way. Take the most horrific, awful thing you can think of and multiply it by cancer. But you'll do fine. You've got Kirito, and he's practically carrying this crew. Practically? Kirito! I'm sorry. So, on that note, what do you guys think? Well, no offense, but that's the most... probably fine idea I've ever heard. That's Whoa. a weird way to phrase that. Don't push me on this! All right, so we got us a game plan. Wait, you didn't say what you're doing in all this. Well, the thing about that is... Later! Wow. We really need to take that ad away from him. God, we've been looking for hours. Where is this stupid thing supposed to drop, anyway? Uh, Kirito, did Keita even tell us which item we're looking for? Son of a- We must save my family! Oh, <laughs> wow. A single chest in an empty room. Don't yeah, try- this looks legit. Come on, guys. Even we're not dumb enough to- That's a mimic. Don't do it. Don't do it. <laughs> Don't do it. Check the back. It's... Bruh. Bruh. Every game has made me, like, second guess a chest. I will let one of my new friends open a chest before I do. <laughs> They'll be like, shit, go over there. Like, nah, man. Like, you just start playing. You you go over there first. And then they get gobbled up by the chest. I was like, oh, shit. Be like, was that supposed to happen? I was like, oh, I don't know. I've never seen it before. <laughs> over this. Sachi, you set them to auto loot, didn't you? Yeah, I thought it would save time. Oh yeah, we're sprinting to our deaths at record speed! Well, it might not be a trap. Maybe we just want a prize or something. Deploying Slaughternaut and Murder Golems. Oh wow, Slaughternaut and Murder Golems? It must be my birthday! I thought you were gonna be nicer! Baby steps! It's okay, we'll just grab one of the teleport crystals from Gary! Who the fuck is Gary? We must save my family! <laughs> that was scary. Of course it was! No, 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 it's fine! Charlie's got a bunch of health potions! Which one's Charlie? Never mind, I got it! Well, we still... Oh god, stop! Look, we're just gonna have to fight our way out! Okay, I'm scared, but I trust you. Do, 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 do. Sachi! No! Naruto, <gasps> this isn't your fault. Your fault. Your fault. Your fault. Bye! Well, that was grim. But as with all things, there is always a silver lining. For you see, Kirito still had one friend left with whom he could share his grief. Kata! Yeah! Kata! Christmas! Yay! Christmas! N nigga, what? No one kills themselves on Christmas! <laughs> Christ, I need more bourbon. They say the Santa Claus will appear beneath a certain fir tree tonight and grant whoever finds him an item that will give anyone a Merry Christmas. Now that'll be 200 go- Oi! Oi, where are you going? Get back here! Balls? My, My name, name is Klein. Klein. That was unsettling. What the hell was that? I correct people so often, they think it's how I say hello. Well, that's unfortunate. Yeah, no kidding. So what are you doing out here? Yeah, I've been having this weird pain in my chest. I was hoping this rare item might be able to fix it. Well, that's strange. What do you think caused it? Well, I suppose it started right after I watched my entire guild get slaughtered. <laughs> oh, God. But I mean, I didn't take any damage, so that can't be it. Oh, my God. Scary though, as the sole survivor of the Midnight Black Cats, the debt naturally falls to you. The Don sends his regards. Well, as many questions as this raises, I'm gonna keep this brief. Kirito, you're not injured. You're sad that all your friends died. Wow, I never thought about it like that. Yeah, big shock, you friggin' sociopath. <laughs> Look, I've heard rumors that item might be able to res players. It's a long shot, but you owe it to yourself to try. Go on ahead. We'll hold them off. Why? That's the nicest thing. Why? 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 Okay. Thing anyone's ever done for me. Thank you, Klein. <laughs> hey, boss. Who's Klein? Don't ruin this for me. 
And but there, why? under that frosted fir tree, Kirito spotted the big man himself, streaking through the snowy sky on a sleigh full of Christmas cheer. The patron saint of prostitutes! Look it up. Old Saint Nick. Naughty. What the fu- Is that Krampus? Kirito, how'd it go? Did you win? Does this look like the face of victory to you? You didn't get it? Oh, I got it. It's a hat. It's a goddamn hat. Well, what do you want to do with it? Wear it, poop in it. I don't really care anymore. But I do suppose I should thank you. You made me realize that by being nice and letting people in, they'll just die. But even still, thank you for showing me that there's still a part of me that can feel like this. Because now that I know where to find it, I've killed it forever. <laughs> so thank you. Thank you for freeing me. Balls. No. No. You were so close. You were almost a person. You were so close. And so they say, Kirito's heart grew three sizes that day. It immediately shrank six, imploding into a black hole from which no love could escape. Damn. The end. Oh, I'm sorry. Were you expecting a happy ending? Well, I'm afraid the world doesn't work that way, bucko. The only thing you can hope for in life is that you make enough money to fill the void left behind by the woman you love when she takes your children to some island in Tahiti with a cabana boy half a fucking age. Well, look at me now, you harlot! I'm still alone with all my money. God, I'm alone. Damn. So alone. <laughs> Should I be here? It's like, it's like... Merry Christmas, everyone. Oh God, it's in the Persian rug. Okay, should I have? B okay, they said watch the end credits. Uh. Okay, I'll make sure I'm watching the end credits. I'm sorry, Don. We finally tracked down the one known as Kirito, but we were beaten back by the legendary warrior Balls Deep Sixty Nine and his men. The boy escaped us yet again. Okay, did the anime style drop or just just <laughs> what the fuck? I have no excuse, <laughs> but I promise you. We will get back what was stolen. What are your orders? Don Fluffles. What the fuck? Something witty. Hold up, making sure, making sure, making sure, making sure. Okay. All right. Um, I don't know how I feel about that. <laughs> I mean, hey, um, uh, I guess people celebrate Christmas a different way than I do. I mean, like, I don't know. I don't know. Um, people tried to warn me that this this episode wouldn't be uh that funny. It, it wasn't. It wasn't as funny as I thought it was. Uh, like, I have my expectation is at a four, and it, it hit me at a two. So maybe, maybe, maybe you only can go up from here. And I mean, it's bad in a two and oh, a, a two and one right now. So hey, we're going we're going to keep going on this thing, okay? So original links for the creator will be down below. Again, my name is Shay Too Sweet. You can call me Shay for short. Uh, you can support me on my links up there, and um, if you want to help uh, help out with a cosplayer too, uh, wish list is down there. Um, again, my name is Shay Too Sweet. Ooh. I'm cold. You can call me Shay for short. And like my grandmother always says, so long. Animals and bitches feeling like the seven getting on their trail tip. You know I'm always stuck with them shirties. If your mama's cribbing bitch, so she ain't serving the spaghetti. Hey, shit ain't sweet. You said you got the number one, well bitch, you miss cause it ain't me.